Hi, welcome to Salesforce Tech Book. In this session, we are going to discuss about what is CMS, how to create CMS workspace, how to create CMS content, and how to add that CMS content to our experience cloud side by using CMS single item component. What is CMS? CMS is a hybrid content management system where we can create, manage, and publish content from CMS workspaces to multiple channels. These channels include experience cloud sites also. We can connect CMS to our experience builder sites by adding the site as a channel to CMS workspace. CMS gives us the power to reuse the content rather than duplicating the content. By using CMS, we can provide the content to multiple sites and also updates the content centrally to present it everywhere. Experience Cloud has two CMS options. CMS is built in our app for creating and sharing the content with multiple channels. It allows us to manage different language versions of our content and controls who creates our content. Second one is CMS Connect. It is a tool for embedding content from a third party CMS in our site. Now we will see how to create the content. To create the content, first we need to create the CMS workspace. Now we will see how to create the CMS workspace. Go to our app. We can access CMS workspaces from Digital Experiences Home app. So go to App Launcher. Search for Digital Experiences Home. Select Digital Experiences Home app. Previously we have Salesforce CMS app. Now it is renamed to Digital Experiences Home. Now we are in Digital Experiences Home. Here we have CMS workspaces and Experience Builder. CMS workspaces are used to create and organize the content. Here we can set the languages, select contributors and share the content to experience cloud sites or other different channels. Workspaces also limit the access to the content. By using experience builder, we can create the sites. We have already created the site. Now we will see how to create the CMS workspace. To create the workspace, click on create a CMS workspace. Give the workspace name. If we want, we can give the description. If we select CMS workspace, then we can create and publish the content to all sites except enhanced LWR sites. If we want to create and publish the content for enhanced LWR sites like micro sites or build our own LWR sites, then we will go for enhanced CMS workspace. Now we will go with CMS workspace. Click on next. This is our site name. Here we can add our site as a channel to the workspace. We can connect CMS to our experience cloud site by adding our site as a channel to the CMS workspace. Click on next. Here we can add the contributors. Contributor is a user who has access to CMS. Contributors are either content admins or content managers. Content admins have access to perform administrative tasks in the workspace. Content managers have access to create and modify the content. Now I am not adding any contributors. Click on next. Here we can add the language. Select English and click on add. We can select different language versions of our content. Here I have selected only English because I want to make our content available only in English. If we want, we can add other languages also. Click on next. Select default language. Click on next. Here we can review and if we want to do any changes, we can do. Click on done. Now the CMS workspace is created. Now we will see how to create the content. To create the content, we can click on create content or we can click on add content. Here we have three content types, document, image and news. These are the standard content types. If we want to create custom content types, then we can create by using CMS content type creator app from the app exchange. We will discuss about how to create custom content types in the coming sessions. Now we will go with standard content types. Select news. Click on create. 
give the title you body add banner image click on add image click on add content click on upload files select solar panels image click on open once we create the news content type image content type is also created give all text These are the fields for image type. Click on save. Give accept. Click on save draft. Click on publish. Click on publish. Once we publish the content, then this content is available for the channels like Experience Cloud Sites. Now we will see how to add this content to our site. To add the content, click on gear icon, click on setup. In quick find search for digital experiences. Click on all sites. Click on builder. To add the content to our site, go to components. We can add the content by using CMS collection, CMS connect or by using CMS single item components. Now we will see how to add the content by using CMS single item component. Drag and drop this component. To add the content, click on add content. These are the content types we have created. Select news content type. Click on save. To make the content visible, we have to do the field mappings. Click on content layout. Click on field mappings. In headline, select title. Subheading, select excerpt. Image, select banner image. If we want to change the button text, we can change from button styles. Select button styles. We can change the text here. If we want, we can change the button background colors also. We can change the content layout. We have selected banner layout. We can select tile. Or we can select card layout. Now we will go with banner layout. When the user clicks on read more, then he will navigate to the detail page. Here we have selected the news content type. So he will navigate to the news detail page. Now we will customize the news detail page. To customize the page, go to pages menu. Search for news detail. Select news detail. Go to components. Drag and drop 
CMS single item detail component. We can add CMS single item detail component only to the CMS content detail page in Experience Builder to customize the content layout of detail page. It allows user to see the content in full. To make the content visible, do the field mappings. Headline select title. Subheading except image banner image content body select body this is how uh, we can customize the detail page if we don't have detail page then we will show how to create the detail page Click on new page, click on CMS content page, here it shows the content types, here it is showing document and image because uh, there is only one detail page for each content type, we have already news detail page, that's why it is not visible here, select document or image, I am selecting image and click on create. This is the image detail page. If we want, we can customize the page. Click on publish. Click on publish. Click on got it. Now we will see how the customer user can view the content. I have already logged in as a user by using his username and password. Before adding the content, he can view the site like this. Refresh the page. This is the content we have added. Click on read more. Now the user will navigate to the detail page. This is how we can create the content and add the content to our experience cloud site by using CMS single item component. In the next session, we will discuss about how to add the content by using collections. These are the references. Please go through those references. Please subscribe to Salesforce Techbook. Thank you.